Meet Jasmine Bennett, a six foot two junior middle backer at the University of Louisville. Jasmine was the 2014 Region 1 Kentucky Player of the Year, and she came to Lowell from McCracken County High School in Paducah, Kentucky. As a kid, Jasmine did not want to play or compete in any sport, but her friends convinced her. I was not competitive whatsoever. When I was growing up, I didn't like being in front of people. I was really shy. Starting fifth grade, my best friends, when I moved to Paducah, Kentucky, my best friends were in Little League and that was the way for me to make new friends, so my mom just threw me in and I ended up sticking with that. By her sticking with volleyball, that led her to a scholarship. Jasmine is coming off her best season last season as a sophomore, where she earned a starting role. She recorded back-to-back -back career performances when she finished with 14 kills versus Boston College in Syracuse. Last year was definitely my first year playing. I was nervous for sure, but it was really exciting. I feel like I've learned a lot about myself just through that period with all the comp competition in the ACC and everything. Um, I feel like I can only go up from where I started. She's just a really humble person. I think she's definitely put in the work for the volleyball and you know she's getting what she's earned. So she's a great person and I'm so excited to have her on this team for my last year. Jasmine's hard work came from her father, Winston Bennett, who is a former Kentucky basketball player. He played four years at Kentucky and served as an assistant coach under Rick Pitino for two years. There's still a lot of people wondering how Jasmine ended up at Louisville and not UK. It was interesting when I committed. It, it definitely blew up, I would say. Um, he was a big star back in his day at UK, and then me getting offered a full ride. He's definitely happy with whatever school I went to because I don't have to pay for it. Well, you would think I would have lived that down, the fact that I chose UK over my home, University of Louisville, but I still, still haven't. So my answer to the question is, one, my daughter has just righted my sins for all the Louisville fans. I got a daughter at UofL and she loves it. You'll see him though. You'll see him in red, for volleyball at least. I, don't, I can't tell you about any other sports though. <laughs> Jasmine says her father has been the greatest influence on her athletic career. My dad's been that person that's there for me all throughout sports, athletics, even in school. Uh, mainly he just, he's kept me motivated, I would say. He's never wanted to see me give up. He's always given me advice when times are hard. Anytime your daughter says that, one of your kids said, say that about you, it has to make you feel great and it, it truly does uh, for me, but I know who to reflect that praise back to because it's, it's nothing to do with me. Everything to do with uh, the parents that parented me, my mother and father. And he's keeping that tradition going by supporting his daughter and being behind the bench every game. My dad is, if you come to a game, you won't miss him. That's for sure. Front row, he has his towel, loves to swing it. He's got nicknames for everybody, whether you're playing or on the bench. He loves to cheer. He's like, I wouldn't say a mascot, but if you come to a game, you're like, you're going to be entertained, I would say, say the least. I'm Bradley McKee, Spectrum News.